And it's fascinating, Sandy, you and me have both worked with this uh, CPG company, we you know, uh, where the CEO is using this literally as an execution tool, right? He knows that um, he's kind of got two normally separate activity systems. There is a, you know, some budgeting planning process which keeps happening and review of that plan, the financial plan, which is happening every month with numbers. And then you have a separate activity system which is about talent, right? Which happens maybe once in six months through a performance management system. Now using both these together and, you know, it's really pushed the reporting, the financial reporting and the talent sitting in these critical roles. And he's using the value coaching interventions as his execution tool. So now every um, two weeks, he's looking at a set of five uh, role talent cards and the value coaching plans. And the idea is that, you know, he's not just talking about uh, performance and, and people differently, but it's doing it in the same meeting. So it's almost like, um, so we would say that it's become a monitoring tool in a way, or an execution tool. So it's gone beyond just value coaching interventions. So I find that really, really fascinating that it's. Yeah, and you know, I think, I think your, your point about that, you know, these have traditionally been separate yeah. activity systems. And you know, and if we think about, um, the the review cycle yeah. as it relates to talent. Most review cycles historically for talent have been annual. Yeah. And of course, before that, they were once every four or five years. Oh my. Yeah. You know, when when we were doing long range planning yes. and so on, you would then consider, well, what is the workforce plan that is going to go along? with these long range plans. Yes. And then it was a revolution or a revelation and then a revolution that we should do it annually. Yes, I remember and that. that felt like quite a change. And then when we look at the uh, back to this the 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 rate of external change, it's now happening so fast that virtually anything you do annually is useless. It's useless. Yeah. It's, it's, it's virtually useless. And so say, okay, then we need now a different rhythm. Yes. And people are finding also that these things go together. So talent and value yes. go together. And so the system that we look at to evaluate value, value creation, and so on, strategy, finance, you know, these kind of things which often are connected now we're talking about connecting strategy, finance, and talent. human resources yeah. and talent together in order to connect talent to value. And that's different. And we're doing it at a pace and a rhythm which is at the speed of change. Yeah, and it's quite fascinating for me because not only is he using it like that, but I'm beginning to see that, um, you know, there are times when we've, with all good intentions, we've created a value coaching intervention plan, but it's just not working. And you don't want to know that after a year, right? You want to know that in a cadence, just like you would like to know is sales coming or not coming. You know? Right. It, it, that, so that's, that's for me is quite fascinating as well.